are the best tips for staging your house to sell? Well, that's what we're talking about today, and we're starting right now. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Angela O'Hare, a realtor here in Las Vegas, Nevada, with the O'Hare team at Urban Nest Realty. If this is your first time here, consider subscribing by clicking that button down below and even that little bell for notifications. When you're selling your home, you want it to look its absolute best for potential buyers who walk through the door. That's where home staging comes in. The first step to getting buyers to make an offer on your home is to impress them with its appearance so that they envision themselves living there. Here are 10 tips for making your home look bigger, brighter, and more desirable. Number one, start with a clean slate. Before we worry where to place furniture or which wall hanging should go where, your home needs to be spotless before we even begin doing anything. Do a thorough cleaning right down to the nitpicky details of cleaning those light switch covers and the baseboards. Deep clean and deodorize carpets and window coverings. Number two, declutter. Go room by room and declutter items that you will not need between now and moving day. Pay extra attention to cabinets, closets, and pantries. You want to give the impression to potential buyers that your home has plenty of storage. Not sure where to put your extra stuff? Consider getting a temporary storage unit, but please do not store it in your garage. Number three, depersonalize. It's harder for a buyer to picture themselves in your home when they're looking at your family photos, your collectibles, and knickknacks. Pack up all your personal decorations. However, don't leave empty spaces on your mantles or your coffee tables. Leave three items of varying heights on each surface. Number four, scale back on furniture. When a room is full of furniture, it looks smaller, which will make buyers think that it is less valuable than it is. Make sure the buyer appreciates the size of each room by removing one or two pieces of furniture. Number five, rethink your furniture placement. Highlight the flow in each of your rooms by placing your furniture so that it guides the buyers from one room to the other. Number six, add color to brighten your rooms. Brush on a fresh warm coat of neutral paint in every room. Ask your real estate agent for help choosing the right color and then accessorize from there. Adding a vibrant afghan, throw or accent pillows on your couch will jazz up your muted living room, as well as adding a healthy plant or a bright vase on your mantle. High wattage bulbs in your light fixtures will also brighten up the rooms. Number seven, set the scene. Lay logs in your fireplace and set your dining room table with dishes. And for a centerpiece, place fresh fruit or flowers in the middle. Replace heavy curtains with sheer ones that will let in more light. Make your bathrooms feel luxurious by adding a new shower curtain, towels, and fancy guest soaps. That is, after you put all your personal toiletry out of sight. If you have pets, clean your bedding frequently and spray odor remover before each showing. Number eight, erase signs of pets. You may love your cat or dog, but potential buyers may not, or they may have an allergy to them. Make sure you clean thoroughly and remove their toys, food dishes, and water bowls. Number nine, let there be light. Dark rooms are sad rooms. Brighten up all the rooms by letting in as much light as possible. Open the blinds and all the windows, which in addition to letting in more light, it will also make your room seem a lot bigger. Turn on all the lights in your house for showings, including lamps and closet lights. This will make your home more welcoming, and it will also save buyers time from having to stumble to turn on light switches and to figure out which light switch goes for which light. Number 10, make a grand entrance. Mow your lawn, trim the hedges, and turn on the sprinklers 30 minutes before showings to make your lawn sparkle. If flowers or plants do not surround your entrance, add a pot of bright flowers. Top it all off by buying a brand new doormat and adding a seasonal reef to your front door. Staging a home to sell doesn't require spending a lot of money, just making the right decisions. Your agent should be able to help you make specific changes that will add value to your home and will entice buyers to come for viewings. Overall, to get the most bang for your buck, 
your staging effort should appeal to the widest possible range of buyers. I hope you liked my 10 tips for staging your home. As a home seller, what type of topic would you like me to discuss? Leave a comment down below so I can make sure I cover it for you. If you like this video, be sure to hit the thumbs up button, leave a comment down below, share with a friend, and consider subscribing to my channel if you're interested in learning all things real estate in the Las Vegas Valley. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one. When a room is full of furniture, furniture. Hi buddy, my doggie's watching. Adding a vibrant Afghan, Afghan.